welcome back and today we are in my closet this is exciting I've never filmed in here before so I'm pretty excited about that and we are here because I have a huge haul of dormy stuff to show you guys that I got all new for fall I'm really excited about all of these things there's a lot of purple and purple is my color and I do want to thank Adore Me for reaching out and letting me pick all of these items to show you guys and bring you reviews on how they fit. And if you guys are not familiar with Adore Me, they offer bra and panty sets, uh, lingerie, sleepwear, loungewear, activewear. They offer really cute, sexy, comfy clothes, which is right up my alley because I don't want to just be bumming around my house in sweats if I could look really cute while doing it too. And if you are not familiar with how Adore Me works, they do have two ways to shop. You can join the VIP membership, which is where you would have a monthly subscription. And then you can also choose the pay as you go option, which is what I did for several months before joining the VIP program. Uh, you don't have to join any membership to do that. You just go on the website or on the app, add everything to your shopping cart, and just click pay as you go whenever you check out. And in that way, you just shop it like you would any other retailer. So without further ado, guys, let's dive right into this haul. I have all of these loungewear and intimates items, and then I have a few beauty items as well. So the first thing I'm going to go through is all of the bras that I got. Just so that you know, all of the bras from Adore Me do come with matching panties, and on some styles you can even choose different styles of panty. So they'll have like a hipster or a thong or a bikini, boy shirt, whatever it is. So I do like that you have some flexibility with that. I'm not going to show you the matching panties because, you know, I've been wearing some of them and I don't really want to show you used panties, but let's get into the bras. This is Quinetta. This is a smooth kind of microfiber feeling fabric on here and then you have this really cute geometric lace trim and the lace trim goes all the way around to the back and then of course it has this cute little bow on it I love little details like that this one does have fully adjustable straps so they adjust all the way up and down so I love that if you are the type of person that really needs to ratchet up your bra straps like I do, this is a great bra for you. And it's just a really nice basic, you know, t-shirt plunge bra. It's not going to show a lot underneath your clothing, but it's still really super comfortable. And this one is a contour bra, which means that it is padded. And I will go ahead and insert after each item that I talk about. I will put in a picture of me wearing it so you can kind of get a feel for the fit of it. Just for reference, I am five foot three. Really, it's five foot two and a half, but we're just gonna round up. <laughs> the next one is Dilly. Ooh, you guys, look at this. Look at this, like, kind of lattice strap, and it goes right in your cleavage, which is super sexy, let me tell you. Whenever I see stuff like this, I am just like a moth to flame. <laughs> I see it and I'm like, oh, I gotta have that. So this is absolutely gorgeous. It comes in this beautiful red color. This also does come in a black and tan color. I'm not sure what her name is, but this one is Dilly, and if you go to it, you can just select the black one and it will take you to that one as well. It has about three quarters of the way adjustable straps, so it adjusts all the way up to right there. And then the back is this nice breathable mesh. And then from this side, you can kind of see a little bit better um, how strappy this is. You've got two straps right here, and they just lay right across your cleavage. And you will see that in the picture as well. And look at the detailing along this. It has this nice little scalloped lace on the bottom. And then it also has the scalloped lace up top as well. I just love those nice little design features. And this one is also a contour bra, so it is padded. The next one that I have is Madigan. This is an unlined bra. You guys, this color, oh my gosh. This is my color, you guys, this is my jam. Look at how cute this is. You got this adorable little bow at the top and then you have this nice lace detailing and these little flocked velvet polka dots on it, which you guys, come on. This is so cute. And then the back does have a U shape to it, which I love. It's great for helping to keep your bra straps up and giving you a little bit more back support. And it does have a fully adjustable strap on it. And what I love about Adormi's unlined bras is that they're actually pretty supportive and they don't make the girls look 
cone shaped, <laughs> which some other unlined bras that I have tried do that. And this gives you still a nice round shape. And I will just tell you that I feel like Adormi's bras fit very um, true to size to the other bras that I've tried from other brands. So for the bras, I would say that if you are pretty much the same size across the board with your other bras, go ahead and order the same size at Adormi and it should be just fine, but you can always read the reviews, which is what I like to do, to see if they fit a little bit looser around the band or if the cups are a little bit tighter, whatever it is. And then for my last bra, I got Noli, which is a bralette. Oh my gosh, you guys, first off, the color of this, ooh, this is like a beautiful corally red color, and I feel like it's perfect not only for fall, but you could take this right on into spring and summer, and look at the racer back on this. How cute is that? The detailing is just out of this world, and I do want to tell you that the bottom of this has this beautiful wide band, which for me... I've got a bigger pair and they need some more support. That wide band really helps to lift them up a little bit more. And then it has this curved stitching following around the curvature of your breast, which is great. This one is so super comfortable. And with most every bralette that I own, I always size down a size from what the size chart says that I should be so that that way I get a little bit more support with mine. So if you have a larger breast that needs more support, I would say do that. But if you already have a naturally perky pair, which is not me, um, then go ahead and go with your regular size for a bralette. So let's move on into uh, lingerie and loungewear, shall we? The first one that I have here is Jamie. She has a crisscross um, strappy back situation. The straps are fully adjustable all the way up, which is great um, if you need that kind of adjustability. It has a little bit of a halter looking neckline and this gorgeous lace. The lace is not scratchy at all. It's really soft. And then the actual skirt part of it is so soft. It's like this really great jersey knit. And then you'll see this better in the picture, but the top actually has this deep V cut out right where your cleavage goes. You guys, this is so stinking cute. And it's still modest enough, I would say, to wear around like family or, you know, if you're opening the door for the pizza guy. It's not too revealing, but it's definitely got some sex appeal. And with her, I would say that she fits true to size, but it is a little bit of a um, curve hugging cut. It's an A-line, but for me, since my hips are so large, they it does skim over them. So if you would want something a little bit more flowy, I would maybe size up for this one. But for me, it's still pretty good. Next up, we have Michael. You guys, whoo, look at this. It has a lace cutout all the way down to there, all the way to the bottom of it. And it is on both sides. You guys, look at that. You can see right through it, but it's not too revealing. I wear this with a bra underneath of it or a bralette, which you'll see in the picture. You can see the bra through it, but I don't like to show my stomach very much. And I feel like this isn't too revealing on it. The lace is dense enough that it kind of gives you the illusion of having a little bit more coverage than it does. I feel like the fit of the top is spot on for me. And then the bottoms are just these cute little, you know, same satin feeling fabric. And it has this cute little purple lace trim at the bottom. And the fit of these is also pretty good. They fit just like a regular sleep short would. Next up we have Juliana. So here she is. She's got this beautiful racer back um, lace back to it. And then the front has this lace illusion, you know, type of neckline. And that behind it is also fully lined, so you don't have to worry about any showing through. This drapes really beautifully on. I feel like the fit is perfect. And then the shorts are so cute. It has this beautiful lace cut out on the side. How cute is that? And these fit a lot like a cheeky short, which I love. Um, so this one is a little bit more revealing than Michael. Next up we have some loungewear and this one is Fallon. 
this gorgeous purple. Oh my gosh, you guys. The top is just a basic um, satiny feeling tank top, fully adjustable straps, which is great. And it's got this cute little v-neck in the front. Then we have the pant, which is my absolute favorite part. I think these are my favorite loungewear pants that I have right now. They're just perfect. Look at the marl knit on this, this purple and black. It has a cute little drawstring on it that matches the top. It has a side stripe that also matches the top fabric. And it has pockets, which is great. I love me a pocket. And then the bottom has also got a little cuff, so it's a jogger style pant. And I feel like these fit perfect. This set is a perfect fit on me. But I will tell you, the bottoms are quite see-through, so beware of that. This is not one that you will be wearing outside of the house. But for around the house, this is so stinking cute. <laughs> My last loungewear set is Marjorie. It is this cute little black and gray number. It's got a pair of leggings, and I know what you're thinking. You're like, that's a cute little basic tank top. No, guys, it is a cold shoulder top. How cute is that? And it's got like long sleeves, which is great for keeping a little bit warm in the winter, but you still got that little sexy shoulder going out. You'll be able to see this better in the picture, but this is so nice. The fabric is so soft, and it has a little drawstring on the bottom that you can use to make um, the bottom a little bit tighter or looser, however you would like. And then the pants are just a basic, you know, stripey legging. And then you get to the bottom and they've got this cute little ruching. There you go, you can see it a little bit better there. Which is great for me because these bottoms were a little bit long on me because I am so short. So because it has the built-in ruching here, it just makes it look like it was meant to be a little bit slouchier and longer, which I love. And if you are taller, have longer legs, it's still gonna look good on you because it automatically has that little bit of, you know, stretch in there. And then my last Adore Me piece of clothing is this robe. How pretty is this, you guys? This is called Brentley, and it is this gorgeous purple, kind of fair isle printed robe. It's got this cute little fleece shearling number on it, and it has a fully lined hood, which is great for keeping warm. It does have a belt on it, and it has pockets here too. Now the last few items that I have are part of the new Adore Me Beauty collection. They have quite a bit of stuff on there. They have some bath and body type of stuff. They have some lipsticks. I think they have like a little makeup kit that is like an all-inclusive um, little compact thing. But I picked up first some of the bath and body stuff. So I got Terry, which is the mango body scrub. Oh my gosh, you guys. First off, these smell just like fresh mangoes with cream, which is like one of my favorite scents ever. And the little scrubbies in here are not too abrasive and they're not too gentle. It's the perfect little scrubby particles because a lot of the body scrubs that I've tried, they're kind of too abrasive and then it really ends up irritating my skin. This one is not, so if you have kind of sensitive skin, this might be the perfect kind of body scrub for you. And then the matching mango body lotion is Darlene and this smells so good, just like the body scrub. And the most important thing for me with lotions is that it has to absorb quickly and all the way. So sometimes I will put on a lotion, especially on my legs, and it will feel like I have just put on like a latex suit and it's really not comfortable. But this absorbs all the way in. It doesn't leave my legs feeling greasy. It doesn't make my hands feel greasy at all. I love it. This is a great great lotion. And then the last thing that I got from Adore Me to wrap up this haul is a set of lipsticks. So this one is Tyra and, and it comes with Nude, Dusty Rose, Mauve, and Classic Red. I am wearing Classic Red right now on my lips. It is so gorgeous. It is kind of a blue toned red which is right up my alley. That is exactly the kind that I need for my cool toned skin and it feels like nothing is on my lips. I love the formula of it. It is a comfort matte formula and it does not feel like my lips are dried out at all. I will go ahead and insert swatch pictures of them, but let me just show you the other colors right here, right now. So here is Nude. Just a perfect kind of non-dead looking nude, which is great. I cannot do the concealer lips, I just cannot. Here is Dusty Rose. 
Very similar to nude, but a lot more pink in tone. And then we have mauve. Ooh, guys, look at how gorgeous that is. This is the perfect fall mauve color. So there you have it, guys. That is my whole Adore Me haul. I hope that you enjoyed this video. Make sure to check the description box for all of the links to the items that I showed you today. What was your favorite one? And if you have shopped Adore Me before, let me know what your favorite set is that you have bought because I am always on the lookout for new sets that I can try because I am always on there looking to see what's catching my eye. I hope that you enjoyed the video, and I will catch you guys next time. Bye!